Assalamu alaikum guys how are you i hope you all are doing good and uh, in this video i am going to show you a full review of the latest Huawei OS unofficial build its Huawei OS version is 3.5 i already made a video on the official build but this one is better than the official build so without any further ado let's get started few issues has been fixed in this rom like uh, in the official build the if it is showing the vendor issue and gps was not working good and uh, in this rom the developer has been fixed all the issues so this rom is pretty stable and uh, it is working pretty much fine as you can see here and in the clocks we have a new clock over there as you can see here its name is as funny let me show you as you can see here as funny and it really looks really amazing and cool as you can see here and in the wallpaper we only have one wallpaper installed uh, which one is the still wallpaper and if you want to install iphone 11 pro hd live wallpapers just check my previous videos and uh, its overall performance and gaming performance is really good its app opening speed is also good as you can see here it is opening the apps quickly and in the camera we have simple camera but don't worry you can install any camera mode or any g cam from the link in the description so now let's dig into the settings In the settings, first of all, we have search bar, notification, network, internet, connected devices, configuration center. Here we have all available customization. First of all, we have the customization of status bar. From here, you can manage the clock settings. You can enable or disable the status bar logo. And you can see here, you can change its position. You can also change uh, the logo style. Then we have some gestures, network indicator, battery style, battery percentage and status bar icon settings then we have quick settings lock screen settings ambient display here we also have always on display which is working really amazing and it looks cool but it will drain your battery quickly then we have buttons from here you can enable or disable the navigation bar you can play with the system navigation gesture and you can also hide the pill to get the seamless full screen display from the settings and here we also have some uh, power menu and volume rocker button settings you can manage according to your taste then we have gestures here we have jump to camera system navigation bar uh, system navigation preword ringing so I three fingers to screenshot notification and here we also have the uh, edge lightning which is working good it will work on when you receive any notification in your device then we have battery saving option screen animations and then we have the misc in the misc we have advanced gaming mode screenshot type and charging animation etc setting then we have bot section and its battery performance is also really amazing here we have battery saver smart charging adaptive battery option and uh, then we have display section here we have a brightness level adaptive brightness night light dark night styles and wallpaper live display from here you can play with the color collaboration and you can also adjust the picture adjustment then we have in the font size we have a lot of font sizes and in the display size we only have five times for display sizes then we have double tap to wake which is working good and dock screen setting and in the sound we have some sounds and we also have the me sound enhancing qual uh, technology to enhance the sound quality and the fingerprint is working pretty much fine in the system we have languages and input date and time backup reset option multiple users and in the about phone you can check your android version which is the android 10 and its security patch is 5 may 2020 its hubac os version is the unofficial v3.5 and this one is pretty stable and recommended for daily usage 
so if you want to install this rom on your redmi 5 just download the rom plus gfs from the link in the description reboot your device into any installed custom recovery go to wipe wipe everything except the internal storage and sd card now go to install uh, now go to install and flash the downloaded rom plus gfs reboot you will be in this rom so hope you guys like this video if you really did hit the like button don't forget to subscribe my channel keep supporting thanks for watching peace